For those who receive Social Security, Supplemental Security Income, or SSDI, the last double payment of up to $6,200 will be due in October. If you're looking for the most recent information about economic stimulus packages, you found the right channel stimulus updates. I'm Ali, and I'm here today to tell you about some great news. Next month, October. Wow, this is massive. People who receive Social Security, Supplemental Security Income, or SSD may be eligible for benefits ranging from $2,800 to $3,400. Here, then get a cup of coffee, get comfortable, and let's dissect this together. Sure, I'll jump right in. Something has been making quite a stir in the Social Security community, and we're going to talk about it today. October is the final anticipated double payment. According to the Social Security Administration, double payment? I can see where you're coming from now. How is that going to affect me? Stay tuned because we're going to fill you in on all the details regarding this impending windfall, helping you to grasp the concept of the double payment. Now tell me, what is this double payment all about? The benefits are received in a single month, equivalent to two months' value. An anomaly in the calendar and the alignment of payment schedules this year is causing this to occur. All right, let's go into the numbers. There is a possibility that certain beneficiaries might get as much as $2,000 up to $3,400. It could be awarded to others. The numbers don't appear out of nowhere. The maximum benefit amounts for several social security schemes serve as the basis for these calculations. Keep in mind that your specific situation and benefit level will determine the precise amount you'll receive. Keep in mind that this is not more funding or a gift. Simply put, it's an advance on the payment you're due in November. Therefore, keep in mind that although it may seem like a windfall in October, it will not be a regular payout in November. But who can apply? Do you all want to know if I qualify for this double payment? Now we can dissect it by program. Retirement benefits from Social Security. This double payment may be available to you if you are receiving retirement benefits. This twofold payment schedule also applies to recipients of Supplemental Security Income, popularly known as SSI. Yes, this also includes Social Security Disability Insurance SSDI and the people who get it. However, there is a catch. The October double payment will not be sent to all participants in these programs. In most cases, your birth date will dictate your individual payment schedule. If your Social Security payment typically arrives on the second Wednesday of every month, for instance, you might not notice this double payment. You must be aware of your position on the Social Security Administration's SSA payment schedule as there are precise requirements for when people get payments. How has this come to pass? Why is this happening? Let's discuss it. Extra generosity isn't limited to the SSA. A number of variables are involved. The odd thing about this year's calendar is that October 1st is a Sunday. In such a situation, the Social Security Administration usually sends out payments that are supposed to be sent out on the 1st the Friday before. In this instance, September 29th, the standard distribution date for Supplemental Security Income SSI payments is the first of every month. However, payments are sent out on the final business day of the previous month unless the one Easties falls on a weekend or holiday. Regular Social Security Payment Schedule As per the norm, this implies that some recipients will get both their October regular payment and the advance payment for November in the same month. The current scenario of two payments is the result of a scheduling perfect storm. It's getting a lot of attention because it's unusual. Impact on beneficiaries. What does this entail for the one who stands to gain from it? Let's talk about that now. You need to look at the big picture, even though a double payout seems good at first. A boost to the immediate cash flow. October will bring in more cash, I'm afraid. Those who have a hefty bill due soon or who need to buy something substantial may find this useful. Spend wisely. Keep in mind that this isn't additional funds. This is a prepayment for the November invoice. Making ensuring this bigger amount lasts all the way through November will need diligent budgeting on your part annual benefits are unaffected. You will still receive the same amount at the end of the year. It's simply a matter of when you get it. Some beneficiaries may be surprised if they do not get a payment in November, which could lead to uncertainty. In order to keep from going into debt, it is essential that you understand this. Potential impacts on additional advantages. Some people may find that their eligibility for other income-based benefits is affected if they get a bigger payout in one month. Talk to a benefits counselor if this is anything that's worrying you tips for managing the double payment. Now that we have a better grasp of the situation, let's discuss tactics. In this predicament, how can you maximize your gains? Here are a few pointers. 
Instead of making a budget every month, make one that covers two months. Make an October and November spending plan. By doing so, you may make sure that you don't go into debt in November due to spending too much in October. Go over your costs and invoices. Now could be an excellent moment to pay off any big bills you have coming up. Ensure that it does not deprive you of funds for November. If at all feasible, consider cutting costs. Think about putting aside a portion of the surplus money. If any unforeseen costs crop up in the next few months, this could be a lifesaver. Consider your financial constraints. Keep in mind that this bigger payment may impact your eligibility for SSI or other income-based programs. Being informed is always a good idea, even though it usually won't be an issue. Talk to the people living in your home. To avoid misunderstandings or financial hardship in November, make sure that everyone is on the same page if you are sharing expenses with family. The implications for the years to come. We need to take a step back and examine the broader view now. Is there anything we can learn about the future of the social security system from this scenario of multiple payments? System adaptability. This case demonstrates that the Social Security Administration can modify its payment schedule to accommodate beneficiaries' needs in the event of unforeseen calendar events. Communicating effectively is crucial. The need of promptly and clearly communicating any modifications to payment schedules has been underscored by the Social Security Administration's handling of this case. Okay, everyone, today we have covered a lot of material. Now we will review the main points. Because of a peculiar calendar event, the Social Security. Administration is distributing two payments in October. This is not additional funding, but rather a prepayment for the November installment. How much you get is contingent upon your individual benefits and how they are paid out. The key to successfully navigating this short-term shift in financial flow is meticulous budgeting. Please respond to me now. Is this double payment acceptable to you? Does it simplify your budgeting or does it benefit you? Please leave a remark and talk about it. Plus, if you believe this video would be useful to someone, please hit that like button and spread the word. To stay up to date on all things related to Social Security, SSI, and SSDI, subscribe to the channel. My sincere appreciation for your time and I will see you in my next video. Maintain a state of knowledge, be ready, and be careful.